iMessage Stickers is a fun new feature in the Messages app for iOS 10. This allows you to use sticker packs to add some fun and flair to your messages. Different sticker packs can be downloaded from the App Store. You can send stickers by themselves, peel them and stick them to text bubbles, or use them on photos. So let's get started. How do you use stickers? Well first, you need an iOS device with iOS 10 installed. So that's an iPhone, an iPad, or an iPod Touch. Secondly, stickers only work with iMessages, meaning you need to be messaging someone with an iOS device. If your friend has an Android device, a non-smartphone, or even a Mac, currently stickers will just come through as a standard image. And some features, like pasting a sticker over a photo, won't turn out the same on the other end. To get started, open the Messages app and look for the App Store icon. You may have to tap on this little arrow if the icon is hidden. Now, tap on the App Store icon to reveal any stickers that you may have been using. Tap on the button on the lower left to reveal any stickers or apps available on your device. This drawer will show any apps or stickers that you may have installed. Of course, if you don't have anything, tap the Store button and you'll be brought to the Messages App Store. This store is only for messages. It includes stickers, games, and other items to enhance your messaging experience. To download a sticker app, simply find the pack you're looking for and just download it, just as you would any other application. When done, your stickers will appear on the Apps panel below your message. Just tap the sticker pack and you're ready to use your stickers. You can expand the window that shows your stickers by pressing the arrow in the lower right hand corner. This will show all of the stickers you have available, allowing you to easily scroll through it page by page. There's a few different ways you could send a sticker. The first way is to simply tap a sticker and hit the send button. This is just like if you were going to send a photo to a friend. You could also add a comment or some text to the sticker, which will appear directly below it. In some cases, this makes the sticker look like it's popping right over the message. You can peel stickers off of the sticker sheet by holding down on the sticker and dragging it up. Notice you can only stick stickers on text bubbles or photos. You can't just stick them in the white space of the message. You can put a sticker over the photo in the same way. However, the photo already has to be in the message. Just drag the sticker and place it on the photo. When placing a sticker on a text bubble or a photo, you have the ability to scale or rotate the sticker a little bit. You don't have too much wiggle room, but with enough practice you can see how it works. Let go and the sticker will be placed down on the image or the text bubble. If you mess up, it is possible to delete the sticker. Tap and hold on the sticker and select the More option. Then tap the trash can in the lower left hand corner and select Delete Message. Just like other items and messages, you can react to stickers. To react to a sticker, just tap and hold the sticker and select your desired reaction. Your friends will be notified of your reaction. You can also find out where your friends are getting these cool stickers from. Tap and hold the sticker and select the From label. This will bring you to the page in the App Store where the sticker can be downloaded or purchased. Here you can see my Real Rabbit stickers available in the Messages App Store. You can also hide sticker packs or remove them entirely. To hide a sticker pack, tap the App Store icon. Then tap Manage at the top bar and simply turn any item off that you wish to hide. To uninstall a sticker pack, tap and hold down one of the icons until they start to wiggle. You could rearrange the order of your stickers or tap the X in the corner to uninstall the sticker pack. Don't worry, these could easily be installed again through the App Store. Tap the Home button on the device when you're done. Well, that's about it for stickers and messages in iOS 10. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment and tell us what your favorite sticker packs are. Perhaps it's one of mine. Thanks for watching.